So jumping into our terminal where our project is located, let's npm i tailwind CSS. And there's a number of different approaches we could take to get Tailwind CSS actually integrated into our project. We could still use post CSS as we did with version three, or now in version four, there's also a Tailwind CSS Vite plugin specifically to get this up and running. Since Adonis.js 6 uses Vite within its projects for its front end assets, that's going to be the simplest approach to use. So let's target that with Tailwind CSS slash Vite. Hit enter to install both of those. And then once installed, we can go ahead and hide away our terminal. So that we can tell exactly when this takes place, let's first jump into our resources, views, home.edge page, because this actually adds Tailwind CSS via the CDN inside of this page itself. So if we just remove this script, give this a save, we can see that we now no longer have Tailwind CSS applied on our web page here, noted by the now huge Adonis.js logo. Now that we have Tailwind CSS removed from the page, let's jump into Vite and let's get the Vite plugin imported and applied. So we'll import Tailwind CSS from at Tailwind CSS slash Vite. Then we just want to add that plugin into our plugins array and call it as a function. When we give this a save, we'll see nothing actually changes on our browser. And that's because we haven't actually applied Tailwind CSS to our CSS file yet. So we next want to jump into our CSS entry point for our Adonis.js assets, which is within our resources CSS app.css file. Jump up to the top of this and give ourselves a couple of line breaks. All that we need to do to get Tailwind CSS added to the CSS file is to import Tailwind CSS just like so. Once we give this a save, we're gonna see our page changes because Tailwind CSS is now back and included inside of this page. It doesn't look exactly the same because there are some class differences between Tailwind CSS version three and four, in addition to the fact that we haven't applied those custom colors back into this configuration yet. 